you hit him. Go ahead and roll damage to the mage. Seven. So, okay, I'm weakened again. Okay, you are weakened. I know you there guys... There goes that healing potion. You guys like the Wheel of Misfortune still, or...? Alright, yeah. so, also, uh, as an 84-85, uh, you are stunned until the end until the end of your next turn, so... So you are also stunned, good sir. Which I believe mm -hmm. is the lightning bolt. Alright, so Rilgar, your critical fumble... Uh, hits your your ally. All right, so let's go on to the next person, which is uh, the bugbear. I can't do anything with him. Uh, he is going to stay fast. Uh, bugbear on dirt. Attacking with his Morning Star is a miss. It is a six versus armor class. Dirt, you're able to block it with your shield once again. Uh, Arvaldir, you are up. You're in a weakened condition. All right, I'm gonna whip this bugbear here. Okay. You're going to whip or shoot with your bow or what? Whip, whip. Okay. So what is the advantage of of having a whip? Is there any advantage? More range. Well, this is, isn't a, isn't a short bow like 60, 80 range? Very true, but why use the short bow? Plus six to hit versus plus a couple to hit with a with a whip. I mean, your your whip Meh. you don't get a. Uh, let's see, your whip is a. Is it considered versatile? Well, is it not versatile, but is it finesse? I don't think it is. Yeah, it is actually. So you can use your dex bonus but you know which is a plus five so eh, I'd rather get plus seven hit with a bow but that's just me but anyways you, you do hit I mean, with a 17 you you do lash out with the whip and uh, crack it on the side of his face so you can go ahead and roll damage I would rather use my bow that's just my personal opinion but but you do hit with the whip all right so you take he takes a total of uh, Six slashing damage from the whip. And that's it for me. Okay, no other movements or anything? Nope. Okay, uh, Lazar, you're stunned. See you next round. Yep. Uh, Bugbear on the cleric attacks. Uh, that is a ten versus armor class, and you're able to block the blow away with your shield as well. Dirt the Daring, you're up. As we make our way back to the top of the order. Okay, David, I think that, you know what, I'm good with uh, attacking the one directly in front of me again. I think we'll make that work. Okay. Twenty-four is a hit. There are two misfortunate rolls of uh, misfortune, so I'm going to take a... Uh, and seven more damage, sir. Okay, got it. Let's see. This bugbear. He goes down. He is a pile of flesh and fur. Now, I do have movement left, so I'd like to go ahead and move on to his mm -hmm. spot. Advance okay. up. Yep, double movement. Yep. And I am done, sir. Okay, so you're basically blocking the door. I like it. All right, so Rogar, you're up now. You've actually uh, been able to thwart several of the blows of this uh, of this bugbear. I guess you're gonna attack back. Taking a swing with my uh, warhammer. Okay. Wow, that's a very devastating crush, almost a crit. You uh, had four points of damage. Divine Inspiration. Mm -hmm. So there you go. Bryce Crispy Treats. Thank you for the follow. Alright, Dirt. Uh, it looks like Mosk is back on you and attacking. And that is a crit. 
I'm just kidding. It's a miss. It's an 11 versus armor class. I wanted to hear you shit. <laughs> you did? <laughs> <laughs> I, I just hit that magical brown note. <laughs> Alright, Mosk Misk. He misses, and it is now Arvaldir's turn. Did you just say Mosk Misk? I said Mosk Misk Misk, yeah. I got my double K messed up there. Mosk Alright, I'm gonna take misses. out my... Uh... Too short. Take a switch out my uh, main hand for my short sword again, and hop on top of the table and stab the the bugbear. So stabby, stabby with the uh, the with the whip. Hmm. It's a sword. Mm hmm. Tired of getting your uh, only one attack around, huh? Yeah. A twenty-one versus armor class is a hit. Sneak damage on that? Absolutely. Uh, 14. Okay, he appears to be in a uh, pretty bad weakened condition. I'm gonna attack with my old hand. Okay. What? 14 on armor class is a miss. Yeah, Alright, then I'm gonna move 5 feet back again. Okay, I'm going to take an attack of opportunity against. Oh, uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, can I take my bonus action as and take a disengage? I will allow you, but next time you need to tell me beforehand. <laughs> I'm sorry. No problem. Uh, I take my bonus action, disengage, and move five feet back again. Okay, Lazar, welcome back to the fight. You are uh. no, you are no longer stunned. All of a sudden, you just were were frozen there and in shock. You don't even know what happens. You didn't. I'm sorry. You don't even know what happened. So okay. you're up. You can go ahead and uh, get in on this. Yeah, I was ex Yeah, I was gonna ask you if I knew what happened. Okay, so I'm actually going to disengage. Now, all you saw, all you saw was Rogar swinging his hammer, and all of a sudden you went. <laughs> he, black. Yeah, exactly what what he said. He he just basically turned around because he just took that blow to the head. Just as he was turning around, he you you just became stunned for some reason. <laughs> nice and I will use my rest of my movement basically. Okay, so you've used your action to disengage, and you can. There you go. I, just, I like how you're getting as far away as you can. So, all right, that's it for uh, Lazar. Bugbear is going to attack. Let's go ahead and uh, get an attack in on on Rogar. And that is a 20 versus armor class. That's definitely a hit. Uh, you take a total of 13 piercing damage from the hit. This is a, an actual, a very mighty hit that you just took. I am definitely bloodied. Okay. Ooh, wow. You or guys weakened. Are, you guys are all weakened. All right, that's it for him. And actually, he's going to he's going to slide in five more feet. Looks like he's trying to get some kind of position here. All right. And in fact, he's going to move five more feet around the table. Oh, no, he's no, he's going to stay there. So, damn table. I'll let you have that one. The table messed up my my vision on the grid. So, all right, dirt, you're up now. Yep. So the bugbear directly in front of me. I am going to look at him, and I said, and I will, uh, and I say, I will feed your wolf, my wolf, your heart. Like, Your wolf is dead, you petty human! <laughs> and I, I take a swing at him. Uh, 14 versus armor class. Do you not see that livering lump of flesh behind you? <laughs> uh, is that your roll? 14 versus armor class? 14, yeah. Okay, that is a miss. Alright, I'd like to use my actions, uh, action surge and do another attack. Okay. That, 17 versus. That is a hit. Okay. You muster yeah. enough energy to get another swing with that your action last. surge. And damage. Alright, so a as you hit Mosk, uh, you, you hit him right upside of his head, and his eye patch flies off as he falls to the ground, and he's looking at you, and he has two perfectly good eyes as well. And then, after several seconds his eyes close very slowly 
as it appears he is dead. Yay! <laughs> fucking was wearing, a phony. Wearing a fucking eye patch, I, dude. No, I, no. I got movement, so I'm gonna no, go you ahead don't. and move. Your action surge was oh, to okay. get one That's other right. action. Stops. You're right. You're right. You're right. I'm sorry. You're right. All nope, right. I'm sorry, bad. dirt. I was just trying to cheat the system. You know how I do. Hey, that's that's why I'm here, sir. All right, Rogar, you're up now. Following the bugbear, I uh, around the table, I swing with my uh, warhammer again. Okay, attack away, what? sir. Uh, that is a miss. Yep. All right. Let's see. Arvaldir, you're up. All right, I'm gonna move five feet into his uh, into this area and gonna do my attacks again on him. You gonna stabby stabby? Shanky shanky. <laughs> See if he gets a sixteen. Eighteen. That's a hit. Can you take him out with the sneak damage? Nine. Oh yeah, uh, you get past his defenses. You get your uh, your main hand weapon into his gut. Blood squirts out of it as you as you pull your dagger out. It's like you hit a main artery, and this blood is just pouring out of him as he clutches his side, goes to his knees, and dies. All right, you guys are uh, out of combat. Uh, let's go ahead and take our break real quick. Nice job, guys couple bad critical fumbles. I think you guys actually took more damage from the critical fumbles than you did the actual... Bu oh, I don't know. Rogar took a pretty big shot, so... Yeah. Alright. Actually, so did the mage. So. Alright. I will see you guys in about 10-11 uh, about minutes or so. I've got to get a quick bio. I'm, I'm, like, dancing over here, so... See you guys in a gotcha. few minutes. Bye, bro. Yep. Alright, everybody. We're going to take a real quick break. Uh, I'm going to run three minutes worth of ads, and by the time I get back, everyone, uh, I should be back from my bio and my drinks. We're just talking about what we need to do after we level up. Yep. Ah, I got gotcha. you. You guys excited about that? Hell yeah. yeah. All right. I'll give you your EXP now. You guys get nine EXP for this encounter. <laughs> <laughs> that was well worth it. <laughs> we are fucking troll. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Uh, everybody gets uh, 150 EXP apiece. Well, T Sergeant Seuss. For you smacking us. Thank you very much for the follow. Or for us smacking each Thank other. Thank you for the follow, Sergeant. Carry on, soldier. I'm just happy I wasn't back in that portion hey, of the room because it was ugly back the there. You're the one that bad talked my god, my <laughs> deity. Yeah, what's going on with that, Arvel dear? And then the little <laughs> snooty comment at the end there. I think that's probably what give you the divine damage. <laughs> Sorry, the radiant damage. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Tyr didn't like that. So what do you guys think? One fifty, Dave. Uh, one hundred and fifty a piece. Correct. So nine forty? No. Ten forty. One thousand forty. Right now. Yeah. What do we think about what? Sorry. Congratulations, you guys are level three as well. Yeah. Woo! -hoo. Level three. Everybody is now officially their archetype. Spring. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's pretty cool. You guys will, uh, you guys can worry about that stuff after the game tonight. So, what are you guys doing? Um, I uh, sorry. So I look Touching back. myself. I, oh. I look back at the guys and I say, "Hey guys, secure that goblin real quick." <clears throat> uh, maybe the rogue should do that because I'm hurt. Want to tie him up there? Uh. I'm going to take oh. care of myself before Wait. I help other people. Oh, You're there, right, uh, Orville, dear? Yeah. Go up and time up. 
Well, is he still alive? All I saw was this goblin come in and he fell on the ground. Was... Oh, he passed. <laughs> he, he, passed out. he passed out, but we didn't kill him, so let's make sure he's tied up good and secure. Yeah, he's, well, he's well, unconscious. He died of a brain aneurysm and, you know, passed out. He's breathing. But we don't know if he's dead or alive. You can see that he's breathing. Yeah, you can see that he's definitely breathing. And then I yell at the guy. Oh, he just no, he just he just got excited from all of the. Looks like he just got excited and fainted. I mean, he put his he put his hand up on his forehead and said, "Oh!" Did a circle and then hit the ground. Mm. <laughs> so Interesting. dramatic. Would it I was. Know that goblins do this normally. No, this actually. Is normal goblin thing. <laughs> no, no. Usually goblins <laughs> are, are are sly little fighters. That's for sure. Mm. It's just a different coloration or uh, on him than normal goblins I've seen around. Mm. No, he appears to be just a normal goblin. So not like a half breed or anything like that. No, Nagaso, thank you very hey, much Dave, for the follow. I turn Nagaso. down. I turn around and kneel down to my wolf, and I yell for uh, Rogar to come here and help me with my wolf. Mm. One moment, please. Let me finish touching myself. Oh my gosh. As soon as you're done fondling yourself, I can use your assistance with my wolf. Hey, I heard like you. Uh, uh, oh, thank there. you very much, Orange <laughs> Autumn. I appreciate like I it. I said before, they're not easy little, you know, tieflings or anything. Thank well, you very they're much easy for the when sub. you're an Eldridge Knight. Thank you very Do much, Orange Autumn. Now you get so the bag face in myself and cast cure wounds on myself for eleven hit points, so I'm no longer bloodied. Welcome to the uh, welcome.